Hi Taurus, it's Elle here to do your April 2020 reading. Um, I want to say thank you to all of you who like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. Um, happy birthday too to some of my, I guess late in the month, right? It's Taurus. Um, do know that this is a general reading. It will not resonate with everyone. It cannot. If it does resonate with you, like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. Um, it's much appreciated. Let's get into this. So Taurus, um, well, you know what? Let me be fair. I did the shells on all the other side. Go for you. What's going on for Taurus? Okay. So we have friends, open, hell, wow hard and crazy my gosh what's going on some of you feel like i just keep hearing open marriage open relationship you want friends in the relationship for some of you it's hell it's feeling like it's hell being locked down, being committed to just one individual. Some of you feel like it's hard. Or this is how the person you're with, they feel like it's hard. And they feel like maybe it's making them crazy. It's making you crazy. Something of that nature. Um, be open to talking to friends about what's what's going on in your household and your marriage maybe they can provide some some good advice somebody's calling you crazy someone thinks you're crazy for doing whatever it is you did or you are doing um you may be changing around your career uh, you may be leaving a job or you may just maybe putting a lot of energy effort and time into your own business or a career change let's see what's going on for a Taurus Taurus Lord God give Taurus a beautiful message of clarity light and love all right okay okay so There's a lot of bickering and arguing. It may be in a relationship, a marriage, or even about a business, or even in a business. Um, you're trying to think, have a clear mind, make a decision in peace and serenity and not in conflict and chaos before you make some big decision about your foundation, about your home, about your children. Um, maybe you're a mother or around surrounding your mother something making a big decision before you you choose to move to move on to put yourself first to have some beneficial change come in you may be a little scared or something is toxic here or there may not be enough money resources um in which that leads you to fear fear-based thoughts You're, there's inner conflict in regards to you moving something forward some of you are trying to get pregnant it's just not happening it it might be on the man check his sperm count um, something of that nature something is holding you back or down yeah, it's making you have a lot of anxiety here. Um, it might be that you're in love or you have love for someone. And there's there's challenge here in the relationship and the dynamic, whatever it may be, the friendship. But you feel like if you if you just speak, if you just be clear in your communication, or you wanting this other person to be clear, 
you could be dealing with a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Um, you want them to be clear in their communication so that you guys can get over this hump, right? And get back to a loving marriage or family life or home life. There may be two or more children involved here. You could be dealing with an Aquarius directly. You want peace. You want to salvage what you guys have. Um, but in order to do that, something's got to change. Someone has to change. Maybe a Scorpio. Uh, someone has to really discover how they have dealt with or they're dealing with particular situations in their life. What is bringing you your happiness? You may just come to realize that this is just your long-term partner and you're always going to have to deal with the up and downs of the relationship. Um, they'll be good, they'll be bad, but for the most part, you are emotionally fulfilled. Even though that you feel like someone is stepping out on the relationship, on the marriage, on the business, you're still in love and you, you're not making any decision to, you may even be making a decision to fight for your marriage or your yeah, fight for your marriage. You may be seeing this in a different perspective now. Having success in some business is bringing you to a place of... Um, you're feeling depleted, but the money will come in. It will Things will turn around because you're on the right path here. There may be a dynamic of you being older and or younger than the person you're in a relationship with. There's someone you want to communicate with, maybe a Sagittarius. You want to speak your truth about how they're in and out of your life, but how you feel like you have a real foundational relationship with them. How you want back, you want to come back to them, how they made you very happy, how you guys can work on the relationship. Um, you know my kids, I know your kids. Someone is saying this. Yeah, someone wants to come back and reestablish. Uh, Let's see what the advice is. What's the advice for Taurus? Um, wow, the four swords again. I think you got that as the first card and the last spread. Um, the advice is for you to really think things through before you make any decision around surrounding or around your foundation, your home, your stability, maybe even a marriage. Uh, there may be legal issues here and you're regretting not saying things definitely a third-party situation but you're very much still in love and you're willing to fight for this connection because once again you're very much in love you're almost obsessed with this person a Gemini Libra Aquarius you're obsessed with having that happy home life you don't want to let it go um, you're okay some of you are the third person some of you are dealing with someone who is cheating on their person um, and or you have a person, your person is cheating on you with another person. But you're willing to fight for this connection. You are not willing to let this go. There's someone who you want to, maybe a fire sign, Aries, Sagittarius, Leo, who you want to reestablish a connection with. It was disappointing. They cheated. They lied. But you feel like there's a real connection here. You may be looking in on them from afar. You have a husband. Uh, this is a husband. A Gemini, Libra, Aquarius husband. They may be keeping options open. They aren't going anywhere. And I think you know that. And you're willing to fight for this marriage, this relationship. And or someone else is. Um. Let's get some additional advice by way of the Angel Answers cards. Not the right time. And it's up to you. Remain positive. Within the next few months, improving health. Maybe some of you are sick or you're dealing with someone who is sick. 
Big happy changes. Okay. We have a yes answer. Okay, so we clarify our yes and no answers here at the channel. So let's go ahead and clarify this yes answer. What is this yes answer for Taurus? Yes, you're going to have money come in. A large sum of money. It's going to take you to a new level, new status. Um, you may kind of hoard it because you want to stay there. Um, yeah, you may be able to move now. You may be able to... Wow, make some plan in secret. You yes, somebody is holding on to something and not telling you that may they even maybe stepping out on the relationship, but you feel like it's a connection. They feel like it's a connection. Could be a cancer person. Yeah. You feel like it's a successful relationship marriage. But you you're at a crossroads or you want someone else to be at a crossroads. In regards to dealing with someone else, you want them to make a decision. You want to communicate clearly. Maybe with the Sagittarius. And that came up in the first reading. Star card at the bottom of the deck. Could be dealing with Aquarius. Some of you, yes, you are the other person. You know that. You're holding on to this person for dear life. But you want them to walk away. You want them to have the strength to come towards you. Some of you, you, it's a marriage where you know that your person is stepping out, but you're willing to fight for the marriage. You're willing to stand your ground. You're not letting this person go. If you feel like this relate, this reading resonated for you, go over to the website. Um, book your own reading there. Uh, take advantage of the text question. You can text a question or two to the number below if you have a question about is my person cheating are they lying um will they choose me will this person leave this person i don't know um you can text your question to the number number below receive the answer to your question to the number below um you can pay for your question on your mobile device also so it just makes me more accessible to you you accessible to me taurus um really not too heavy energy but definitely something where you guys have to really figure out if it's worth it some of you want to fight for it whatever it may be okay all right Taurus take care many blessings to you